What's going on guys, welcome back to a brand new video. Today, I'm going to be showing you guys seven things that you may have missed in the My Team blog and video trailer that came out last night. I was going to record it last night, it was a bit late for me and everyone else in my house was sleeping. But these are seven things that may have slipped under your eye, may you may have missed completely when looking over this blog. There was a lot of information, it was a pretty chunky read, around 15 minutes. So there may have been a few things that you missed and I came down to about seven things that people are starting to look at and on Twitter. But I'm make sure I'll cram it into this video. I'll try and make this video as short as possible and let you guys know these seven things that you may have missed. Now, the first thing here is actually on the draft segment of the blog. You can see here the image that we have. We're given uh, a look at how the MyTrain draft board looks like. There's the seven total packs. There's the uh, there's the six packs for the coach and then the five positions. But there's also the blue on the left, which is Colossal. And uh, that appears to be what will be our first, uh, like our first Friday drop for the year. Um, I forgot what day, the, I think the game comes out on a Thursday from memory. I'm trying, I'm trying to think, I think it's a Thursday night. I might, I might be mistaken with that. However, this could be our first Friday drop. This could be the first content that we see, and it is titled Colossal. And I'm pretty sure from here, it's got Shaq on the cover. Shaq in his Lakers jersey with the lightning in the background. So there it is there. That could potentially be our first Friday drop, which is the Colossal Packs. As you may have missed in the thank you section of the blog, down in the middle of the first paragraph, there is a mention of a new game mode, Play With friends triple threat. This means that no longer do we have to try to, if we want to play against our friends, we have to try and match them in TTO. We can now have a separate game mode where we can queue and invite our friends, or invite our friends, and match up. That could open the opportunity for wages, for content. This could, this could be, this is very, very good. This is something that a lot of people have asked for. It's not a, it's not a huge thing, but it's something that makes life a lot easier for content, for wages, as I said. This is overall a very big thing and may have slipped under a lot of people's eyes when looking at this. Now, this one's a bit of a big one. This has got all the level rewards that you may have missed. On the video, if you have a look at the trailer, there is a quick fly-through of all the level 40 rewards. Um, if you did miss out, you can go through and slowly look and chop and look at all of the different rewards. But for all the players, um, I've got a quick summary here. We've got level 7 is a 78 overall Darwin Ham. Level 13 is 81 overall Larry Nance Jr. That'll be very nice card to have. Uh, level 20 is 85 overall Damon Jones. Now, if you're a 2K21 player, you know that that gold Damon Jones is an absolute demon. So having an 85 overall one now is absolutely awesome. Uh, now, level 24, we have an 88 overall Brian Winters. Level 28, we have a 90 overall Vin Baker. And level 33, we have a 92 overall Kelly Tripuka. I can't say his name correctly, but there it is there. Had a bit of a Google, he's a bit of a historic player, but there are the uh, there are the rewards that you get between level one, which is Kobe Bryant. If you don't know, it's a Sapphire Kobe Bryant. Uh, oh no, sorry, it's a it's a uh, free agent Kobe Bryant. I'm pretty sure from start. So you got the start, and then all the way at the end, you got Carmelo. And throughout this journey, you've got those cards. Um, obviously, I think in terms of my favorite one, that Larry Nance Jr. at level 13 looks like an absolute demon. But Damon Jones at level 20. If you guys use Damon Jones, you know in challenges that man goes crazy. So an 85 overall Damon Jones, a very exciting to try him out. Now, on top of this, if you did uh, go through the video very, very closely, you will see that contracts still remain in the game. Um, they're never going to get removed from what we know. Like, a lot of people don't like them, but however, contracts are still in the game. There is a diamond contract towards the end, and there is uh, contract packs th scattered throughout the level 40s and other places in the video as well. So, contracts are still here to stay. Now, on top of this, this was something that was actually mentioned in the blog, and it was actually in the video as well. Bronze and silver cards no longer exist. Now, a lot of people are annoyed at this, mainly due to the fact that this means that contract prices, so if you don't have actual contract cards, contract prices would go up by quite a bit. So if you guys spend your MT on, uh, say, on your bronze players, the bottom of your bench, now it's going to go up by a little bit. It's not a huge amount, but it's going to go up by a little bit, um, unless they even it out somehow, but no longer are bronze and silver cards. The lowest tier is now gold. Now, something that was welcomed last year in NBA 2K21, my team, was the addition of historic coach. Now, last time we got Phil Jackson and Greg Popovich. This time, on day one, you can already get an Emerald Phil Jackson to add to your coaching lineup. Uh, now, get, or to get this Phil Jackson, you need to evolve. You don't need to collect, you need to evolve 
all of the five starter cards. So as you may know, you have the pick of five starter cards to start off with. Uh, you have Trey Young, Donovan Mitchell, Jason Tatum, Jokic, and I can't think of the other one, but you, if you collect all those five cards and evolve them all, you will end up getting this Emerald Phil Jackson, which is a nice reward to have. Obviously, it'll be better than all the other Emerald coaches, uh, but it'll be a very, very nice thing uh, to have Phil Jackson on the sidelines, something that was, uh, it was, it was refreshing when it came out last year, may have been needing uh, a bit of a, a reinstating throughout the year last year, we only really got the two coaches and then that was kind of it for the year, however, if these keep coming out and we keep getting Phil Jackson and historic coaches, then this could be a very, very good thing for my team, and um, as I said, you can get the first ever Emerald Phil Jackson day one of NBA 22, my team. Now, one for you competitive players out there, um, I was a little bit disappointed in this, you guys know that I've been advocating for uh, for Australia to have a fair chance, at, or international players getting a fair chance as qualifying for 250k. However, we now have, you basically have two chances. If you're on a PS5, you have two chances to qualify. You have two game days to qualify. Um, you, you can play on the PS4 version, the current gen version, and the PS5 version. Um, you can play them both on your PS5. There is a separate competition for PS4 and a separate competition for PS5 and the Xbox alternatives. However, you can play on both of them if you want. The game days are completely different. They may be like a week later from each other. You can literally play and you have two chances. So if you do, if you qualify for both, I don't know what you're going to do there. But if you're, uh, if you happen to play in, if you're comfortable with PS4 and PS5, obviously your data transfers across, so you'll have the same cards. You basically get two chances at 250k. So it'd be pretty stupid if you're a competitive player not to go for both of them. Um, it'll be very interesting this year to see how regions go, if we can have more European, more Australasian players in the uh, in the qualification bracket. Uh, there's still the 64 total players that will go through. However, look, if you're an American and you're uh, you're looking forward to it, just go for it. Honestly, just go for it. Um, and if you're everywhere else in the world, the best thing you can do is get on and help other people try to qualify. Um, the, the worst thing here is the waiting times, um, especially because it's going to be like 1am for us potentially. So that'll be a big thing for us. However, I'll still be streaming that and whatnot. So that'll be a big thing for uh, for me. And hopefully we might get a chance of qualifying. You never know. Just to finish up this video, guys, I just wanted to mention two quick things. First thing is I am having a 2 k 22 giveaway across on my Twitter. Uh, a lot of people have already entered it, but that doesn't mean that you don't have a chance at getting it. It's a standard edition of NBA 2K22. It will be, I'll announce the winner on my stream of of the release night, if that makes sense. So I'll be streaming the night of release. It comes out midnight for me. Um, so I'll be I'll be announcing it at like 10 p.m. that night and send the money across so that person will be able to get the money and get the game on the release night, which is very, very good. Um, and the second thing is also logos. If you didn't see, logos were recently announced for my team creators. Uh, it's something I've been really, really hardly working to. Uh, like I've been, I've been passionate about getting one of these. Um, and now that they're in my team, I'm, uh, I'm really excited excited. Uh, if you guys want to support me, head across to my socials. You guys know um, I, I try my best here across on YouTube. I'm going to be releasing a daily or a weekly uh, schedule that you guys will be able to see on Twitter and whatnot of uh, week by week videos and uh, it'll be very, very exciting and of course we'll be streaming across on my Twitch channel. If you guys want to go check that out then go have a look. Uh, it should be in the description below if I put it down there properly. Uh, but thank you guys for all the support. If you, uh, if you like this content, if you're excited for 2 22 and would like to to follow my journey or you like to watch my no money spent series which I'll be doing and my all money spent series I'll be doing a pack openings every week um, if you guys want to be following along for that make sure you guys subscribe down below uh, we're, we're very close to 25k we're getting very very close and I'm very very grateful for all of you so have a fantastic day enjoy yourselves and I'll see you guys in the next video I hope you're ready for 2k22 because I am too peace